Today we're going to talk about renal artery stenosis. So these are the patients who are either very young, less than 35, or older patients above 55 that all of a sudden they have very bad hypertension. Usually these patients are on multiple, let's say three antihypertensives and their blood pressure is still not being managed. This is very important to know because if you have someone whose blood pressure is being managed appropriately with one medication and there is, let's say, small stenosis of the renal artery, do not intervene because they do not have a physiological uh, blockade per abscite. So you can not diagnose them to have a renal artery stenosis per se. So don't go on to those lines of managing a renal artery stenosis. So this is going to be a very young patient and an older patient all of a sudden has very bad hypertension and on the exam you will have an abdominal bruit. How do you diagnose it? Well, you can get a duplex ultrasound or you can get a CTA. Now remember, if their keratin is elevated, you want to get an MRA because it doesn't utilize contrast. Uh, the management is blood pressure control. If they are in uh, extremis and have very bad blood pressure, systolic about uh, uh, 200s, for example, then the treatment is IV fluids and nitroprusside. Now, the operation would be a percutaneous transluminal angioplasty. That is an endovascular approach. You place a catheter, guide wire, and then you place a stent across the stenosed renal artery. It is the first line and usually works well with patients with unilateral blockage. Uh, there are studies showing that just angioplasty doesn't work. That's why the standard is angioplasty with stent. Now, if the patient has bilateral disease or the PTA has failed or the stenosis doesn't allow for a stent placement, then it's an aorto-renal bypass where you pass, uh, place a graft or you can use a cadaveric vein or a um, bovine uh, material or a PTFE graft and then you can make your own pathway that would form a aorto renal bypass uh, to allow for renal perfusion thank you